What's up guys, it's Tyler from Wayland and uh, I'm gonna show you what I use on stage every night. Uh, this is uh, a D-Drum, a Bombardier drum kit. It's uh, a 26 inch kick drum, uh, 14, 16, 18 inch toms and I use a uh, 14 by six and a half uh, tattooed lady snare drum. It's actually made of steel and um, Evans drum heads, Sabian cymbals, Promark sticks. Been taking care of me for a few years now. I can't thank those guys enough. Now you like to coat it over the clear. You Evans know what? Heads? I do. Um, coated heads are just just a little bit warmer for some reason. I mean every six months, maybe maybe once a year, I'll try a set of clear heads on my toms and I'll use them, and then it just reminds me that I do like the coated heads a little better. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but yeah, I'll, um, let's take a walk around here and I'll show you a view from the back side. And your symbols? Symbols are uh, Sabian symbols. Um, big symbols, just like the drums, big drums, big symbols. So I'm kind of uh, uh, a Dave Grohl, uh, John John Bonham kind of kind of guy when it comes to like the big drums and the big cymbals. Um, but yeah, I use I normally use 15-inch uh, hi hats. However, I just put a crack in them, so I had to send those back to Sabian. So I'm waiting for my 15-inch hi hats to come back. So I got a pair of 14-inch stage hats right now. 20-inch um, explosion crash on my left side. And I actually use uh, a 21 inch ride cymbal, 21 inch Sabian AA bash ride as a crash on my right side. And then I use the uh, 24 inch bash ride for my, for my ride cymbal. And uh, yeah, uh, DW pedals. And this uh, Zebra pork pie throne that I've had for about 10 years. My ass has sat on that a lot over the years. <laughs> and yeah, um, Sennheiser mics. And uh, yeah, like I said, Promark sticks. You have a variety of sticks in there for different I, things. I do, I do. Um, I just use a regular Promark uh, 5B Hickory wood tip. And uh, for, for the acoustic shows, I'll bust out these babies. These are made by Promark as well. These are called the Thunder Rods. They make the Hot Rods, which, which uh, look like this. They're a little bit thinner of a, a, wooden, a wooden dowel in there, a little bit quieter. But um, I like the big, heavy, thick ones. And they actually last a lot longer because sometimes during the acoustic shows I get a little bit excited and play a little bit harder <laughs> than I should. And they just last a little bit longer than these uh, normal hot rods do. And uh, I got a set of mallets in here. This is for uh, on songs like, uh, I think on That's Life I use them to do like little cymbal swells like a... Used for that kind of thing, or on uh, song, songs like "When She Rains," they might use them on the on the on the toms. Gives it a little bit of a rounder sound, like instead of a, you know, like the like stick sounds like a. But this gives it like a little more of a, you know, rounder kind of tone in that regard. But um, but yeah, that's about it. I mean, I, I play a pretty a pretty simple setup. Um, you know, a lot of guys use a lot more drums and a lot more cymbals, but. I just kind of find that keeping it simple works works the best for me. You know, if it works for Dave Grohl, it works for me. That's kind of how I look at it. And I see you have an interesting internal microphone mount for your kick drum. Well, actually, I used to have um, in a mic mounted on that. Uh, I actually took it off and I started mounting my 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 uh, kick mic back on the outside again. But now, what what uh, this is? This is a light. Oh, so, okay. so when the stage goes. Uh, completely dark, this light's on, all you see is the W on the front of the kick drum actually, you know, up there, up there uh, glowing, which is, which is kind of a cool touch, I thought. Nice. Well, yeah, that's about it. Simple setup. D-Drum, Sabian Symbols, been taking care of me for a long time, and I uh, can't, can't thank them enough. And you have some, some little electronic toys over there. Yeah, this over here, um, this is what I use for an in-ear monitor system. Um, actually, my molded ears are in the shop getting fixed right now, so right now I'm just using a pair of Shures I picked up at Guitar Center. Um, these are my, my, my uh, backup pair. And then this is just uh, a little mixer, so I can adjust how loud I want everybody or how, or how quiet I want everybody. And um, yeah, that's that's kind of how I hear everybody on stage. And then I also have these have these monitors as well, uh, mainly just this uh, subwoofer. So when I hit the kick, I can still feel it. 
I like to feel a lot. <laughs> a lot of kick drum up here on stage kind of helps me, you know. Keeps keep, you in the vibe. Keep everybody together, yeah, yeah. you know. You know. But yeah, that's about it. And tonight, hopefully, we'll be looking out over a, a big crowd here, here at the intersection. Yeah, looking forward to the show. Awesome. Me too. Thanks, man. Thank you. Appreciate it.